Yeah, we'll ignore those um, rumblings and screamings from out in the distance there. We'll keep on cooking. Hello? Oh, I think Okay, Mark's now arriving. we have a special announcement. Ross are now arriving. They've just pulled up in the limo. Unbelievable. Now you notice the windows are tinted black. Now the thing is that all these people have waited out the front, but it's uh, it's you lucky people in here are actually going to see them face to face. And here comes, is it Matt or Luke? Is it Matt or Luke? I don't, it looks like Matt to me. What do you think, Alex? What do you think? Let's do a race Yes, sir. Uh, it looks very like Matt to me. Oh, my God. 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 See, uh, oh, excitement. The other thing excitement is with the Melbourne advice. Cup's coming up, we want to do a phantom call. Yeah. Now listen, we're going to go and we're going to check out a clip first. And then, of course, oh, no, we're going to look at your, Bross. We're your cooking segment. Look, we'll cook later, Andrew. We'll cook later. Let's have a look at Bross with I owe you nothing. <laughs> It looks like a good show, so if, you, if you're going to the show, I yes. think you know it could be something worthwhile. Three very nice guys. Now, listen, Andrew, it's been a long time. We've been on the factory for over a year now. We've had some very special guests. We have. We've had a cardboard cutout of some people. Haven't yes, we, we gave that away. We've run some very good competition. There's a cu cutout of Bryce. Why don't we, in fact, meet the real thing, ladies and gentlemen? Yeah. seen much. I mean, I've read somewhere that, that most places you go, you don't see, see anything. Um, do you intend to see much while you're here? Well, we're going to have a couple of days off when we get some sunbathing. Here in Melbourne or? Uh, well, in, in uh, Brisbane, I think. Oh. You don't you don't get much sun in England. <laughs> no, at all, actually. Really? Yeah, four, four days of summer, that's about it. That's not much. That's it. You could become anemic. <laughs> it's a wonder of how, of how you're going to keep your blonde hair. Now, listen, Craig, you must, do you sort of feel sometimes that, you know, being the the dark-headed boy of the band. Oh, you know? yeah, again. Does this, does this occur most? Do, do, do many people ask you this sort of thing? Yeah, every, every interview I think we have. No, we've grown up together, you know, so we've, sort of, we've known each other for the last eight years or so, so we've grown up and we've sort of got a relationship like brothers. So it's not okay, it's like we all, all three of us have like You can probably settle an argument for us too. We had a competition, all these guys in the audience um, were in a competition to be in here, and, and the third question was where does the band... <laughs> Ah, you old dog. Where does where does the band Bross originate from? Um, where we're born. Like where, 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 was, where was the band conceived? Now, listen, you had a band called Caviar, didn't you? So was that was that with the, was that the three of you? How did you find that out? Many many years ago, wasn't it? When you were in yeah, high school? Yeah. Was that the three of you or some other people as well? It was well? the three of us. It was the three of us. But yeah, two other. Actually, it was five of us in the band. Right. So. Now, there's a lot of very very impressive sure audience here. All right, listen, I think you guys should help us cook in a minute. We're going to cook, right? We're cooking something great. Something you might like, actually. Yes, yes. We cook every week on this show. Yeah? You yeah. have to do it here as well. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I live here. <laughs> so, <laughs> well, when we come back, we'll get you guys to help us cook, but right now it's time for a band called Crash Politics. Right. All right? And that song is called Stop. And so you just, you stay there and you'll see more of these young Stick boys. Stick glued to your screens, guys. Here's Crash Politics. <laughs> guys. Okay. Listen, it's been a long, long time. We've been building up this competition for an awfully long time. And we've got two, two winners who've come all the way from Perth across the other side of Australia. Now, could you please come in? This is Narelle and City. Now, hey, Narelle. We'd give you a chance to meet him. Yeah. Is that a fair deal? I mean, you paid the money. Hey, you, you guys will sign something for them, won't you? In, in a yeah. short while. All right. Now listen. In a short while, where are we? In a short while, we're going to be oh, doing continue continuing with the cooking, with the cooking. But we're going right now to expensive shoes. It's sort of about expensive shoes. We'll be talking about bros shoes very shortly too. Yeah, you've got a bit of a thing about shoes, haven't you? Yeah. 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 Y
mind. The old docks in a minute, but right now, expensive shoes. I mean, yeah. where do you get them? Where do they come from? Who possibly knows? We'll ask the guys very shortly. I'm too stunned. Yeah. Back. You like the back? You move yes. back. Here we go. See, that's what's happening here. We're going to, to move back. But you people sitting by your televisions, you can in fact move forward. Yes, we move forward. Because that's <laughs> as you like. This is this is the, the bit about the cooking segment we were trying to get to before. Now we're making cookies, so I thought what we should do, Alex, seeming you're leading this, is you can designate jobs for people, and I'll just sit here and watch. All right then. Now, Make at least strenuous one, right? Now, look, this is a very this is a very simple job. All I want you to do is to cream the butter. Now, cream the butter means not, not don't make it too oily. Just sort of make it very very smooth. Is that all right? Just yeah. a, just a gentle sort of gentle sort of action. That's fine. Now we're, we're actually making a dough type me? of mixture. We're making a doughy type of mixture. Up, yeah, that's right. And then we're going to make. Oh, yeah. 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 Are you impressed, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, listen, Luke. You. Yeah. I've read somewhere that you are quite a quite a, a learned sort of gourmet. You like quite a lot of types of food. I just don't like eating in because I can't go to cook it. So you don't like food in here? No, I don't like eating in. I'd rather go out and get some. some yeah, I often. Do, do you guys cook for yourself? Um, no. Now you and do you and Matt live live with, live with each other still at home? We, were, we all live in our own recently. We did all have a flat that we shared. We just recently now live in our own. Now you had problems with people coming to your doorstep, didn't you? Yeah, giving the phone numbers away and things like that. Yeah, we, oh, we, yeah. we've been evicted about four or five times. Four times. Yeah. Because I won't tell my fans to go home, so so um, they chuck me out of my house four times. Right, is that all settled now? You've got a place sort of fairly private? Yeah, I mean, sometimes like, I go to Sunday lunch with my mum. That's good. What does your mum cook you? Uh, I don't know really. No, English, I don't really know. Good, lasagna. good wholesome English food? Yeah, yeah. And lasagna as well. well lasagna, yeah. lasagna. Yeah. Alright, Luke, that's looking. That's right, that's the idea. Yeah, I mean, let's, let's get. Infect I've got to do a show tonight, you know what I mean? This is totally yeah, Come on, watch, watch those things, mate. Where, where do you, how do you think, where do you think Luke's going here? Here we go, no, this is where, this is where. That's fine. We're actually whacking a bit more. All right, now look, while Luke is. Yeah, well, it, it, it. You heard that. We're also having a little private chats over here. It's a very sort of, um, very chatty sort of well, a time. It's formal, isn't it? Very well. No. No. Now listen, while Luke's... I'm dating with Craig at the moment. <laughs> while Luke is straining over the um, the butter and sugar here, we're going to have a look at 1927, if I could. Don't you dare. <laughs> Andrew, yeah. Andrew, I saw it. Did you like a fish called Wanda? No, I just, if you had a watch the album review, Alex, I thought it was no, funny, give, but it wasn't give me, give me the, the lowdown now, personally, Andrew. I, I, thought really it wasn't, it. I thought it wasn't that funny. God, I thought it was a, a cack. A really, really Different funny... Different senses of humour. I suppose. But of course I found the Terminator. Just, no, just kidding. Um, now listen, of course, last night, Roz did their first concert in yep. Melbourne. Now Melbourne, of course, is the, the start of their global tour. Can we please welcome back the guy to talk about... <laughs> Hello again. How are you going? All right, now, this, you, you've chosen Melbourne as the, as the start of your... The, the start of your concert. So what I think we should do is talk about what the rest of Australia or the, the eastern states can expect from your show. I think they can expect uh, that you do a lot of hard work, right. a lot of preparation. We work very hard. Australia is probably one of our most favourite countries in the world. And uh, we just we just put a lot of work into it. We just hope the crowd put a lot of work. Well, they obviously will. Now, like, I read somewhere that um, you were... You always thought it was better to um, make the live performances as close to the recordings as possible. The yeah. thing is that we could have had a lot less people, a lot less people actually on stage right. and had a lot on tape or discs like a lot of bands do. I mean, there's a few on sequence, but it's like we've got a lot of musicians on stage with us to make it exactly like the album. I mean, uh, and, and like Melbourne gets, last night got the first live show in the world and there's a lot of world press there. I think it was brilliant. People it's have brilliant. the impression the more people you have on stage, um, the less live it is, but in fact, the more people you have on stage, the more live it is. Yeah. We could have had three or four people and had a like glitzy band right. with, um, you know, all of it on disc. It's very, but very, very chose tough. To do it. It's the toughest sound in the album. All right, now, yeah. now, Craig, I was just thinking that your your origins were actually um, in heavy metal, really, weren't they? <laughs> do you ever sort of stand there, you know, plucking away like this and think, "Geez, I'd love to break yeah. into some heavy metal." Do you ever get that urge? I ain't got the locks anymore, you know. Right, I mean, I've lost all those. No, I mean, I liked that when I was about twelve. But sort of, that was just a stage it was just a I went through, yeah. So how do you guys feel about heavy sort of music? It's, it's, it's everyone to their own, it's like, it's I like respect rock. it. I like rock, rock is I like rock. It doesn't influence me at all musically, but it's sometimes if you feel a bit like hyperactive and you chuck it on, it's all right, I suppose. It doesn't do much for me, though. All right. But, but Craig, there's got to be something there, you know, Akka, yeah, Dacia and all that. Nah. We've got, no, we got a lot of hard rock fans. He's a closet you, Hugh Leon Glazes fan, really. Oh, right. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but is it true that you only show one side of your face, just like he does? 
one side of his face. Well, yeah, I mean, it shows one side of his face. You got both there. <laughs> no, I, like, I, like, I like Sam Rock and I like, I like Stevie Wonder and I like all sorts of music. Jackson. Yeah. Like Steve, Steve, Steve. No, mainly Steve Wonder. Steve Wonder. And Sorry. Rock, yeah. <laughs> 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 if we could talk about your origin, do you three guys have known each other since early high school? About an hour ago we met. We said, should, yeah. should we do a band? I, no, I, met, I met Luke at the, the delivery stop, table. Yeah. Look, I've been brothers now with Luke for 20 years. Oh. Yeah. So we met, we met, <laughs> met Craig at school eight years ago. We've been in, we've been like best mates for eight or nine years. We've been in bands for like, since we were like 13, 12 or 13. All those years ago, did you think you'd end up national music stars, pop stars? You dream about it, but when it happens and you get off a plane on the other side where it takes you 26 hours to get here, and there's people waiting to say hello to you, you just, you just like, I, I mean, yesterday when I arrived, or the day before yesterday I arrived, it was like, I was shaking. Yeah. I was like, I couldn't believe it, I was so, so happy. Well, well listen, best, best of luck with your shows. Hope the rest of them go as well as last night did. And uh, I'd like you to please thank Bros for being with us. <laughs> get back on your tour right now, but we can... We can have a look at I Quit. And again, I wish you the best of luck. So here's Gross with I Quit. And they quit us. They're going. Bye-bye. Thanks very much.